Good day everyone and thank you for joining this video tutorial which will explain how the new Procon licensing system works. You can start by opening your Procon calcpad and clicking on the license manager in the home tab. Okay, the license manager will open at the license status tab. Here you can see that you need to um, supply your email address and the passcode that was sent to you via email. If you have forgotten or lost your passcode that was originally sent to you, let's try and enter wrong passcode. Click login, and it will tell you that the login has failed because the passcode was wrong. You can have recover your passcode by clicking on the recover button, and the new passcode will be sent to you via email. And you can now enter the correct passcode and click on login after which you will be able to log in you can see that the license health is in blue this means that you are connected to the internet you can try to choose a license that you would like to use now and then press apply The license is now yellow. This means that you are not connected to the internet. To try and re-establish your connection, ensure that you are connected and click on the retry connection button. The license will now be green. This means that you are logged in and, be able, and able to use your license. Okay, next you can click on the bottom left, which it says logged in as, and then your username and your email address. This will bring up a screen that enables you to log out or change your password. The license details tab shows all information regarding your account, which workstations are currently in use and which are available for use. To easily um, renew or purchase new licenses, you click on the order now button the Procon website will automatically open where you can view a price list or order new licenses online or extend maintenance periods. The registered users tab shows all users that are registered to use this license. The email address, computer name, role and status. The role of each user can be admin, manager or user. Admin man users can only be added by Procon and deleted by Procon. Managers and admin can make changes to the license. Users can only make use of the software. Add new users by clicking on the add new users button. This information can be copied and pasted from Microsoft Excel. Users cannot be added on, to, on two licenses at once. A data conflict error will show at the bottom of the screen. Okay. Click on the Manage Users button to reset password, reserve licenses for priority users, change the roles or remove users. The roles can be changed to user or manager. Click on the submit button to submit any changes. Back in the registered users tab, all changes will now be visible. You can always go back to the manage, manage users button and change anything that you might want to again and clicking submit once you have done all the changes. Click on the history tab. The history tab shows license sessions that are currently in use and the sets that are currently being used or Autodesk extensions. The user registration tab shows any changes that was made to the license and if what the result of the changes was. You can also change the time frame in which you want to view these changes by, the today, by using the today, past week or past three days button or changing the dates. Information in all these tabs can be exported to Excel or copied to the clipboard. Should you require any additional information regarding the new Procon 
licensing system, you are welcome to contact us at Brocon Support.